when we're talking about math, um, mm -hmm. I'm gonna kind of briefly go through, the, through, go through these. They need more time to understand um, and figure out how to use basic concepts. Mm -hmm. They may require more thorough revision and review for basic concepts to make sense. So basically this is about time. Just mm -hmm. give them more time. Uh, require yes. more time to perform in math computations, which is basically um, uh, math calculation. So mm -hmm. those basic facts um, with practicing or testing. And pressure a child to perform at a time standard beyond his abilities will only reduce his confidence and make yes. learning more difficult. So mm -hmm. you're thinking, oh, well, we didn't get much done and we were here doing this for an hour, but you have to think about how effective was it within that time frame. Right. Exactly. Did you get yeah. a, did you get a whole bunch a lot done in one hour, but how effective was it? Mm -hmm. you know, was it rushed? You know, was it you know? Did you take your time? Did you bring the visuals in? Mm -hmm. You know, so how much um, how effective was it? So you want right to sure because you, you could walk away from that lesson and come back the next time and they couldn't remember anything. Exactly. And that was not an effective hour, even if they got all the problems right. <laughs> Right, 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 right. Oh, unfortunately, that happens, and that, that's a, that anxiety level. When we do rush, right. that anx anxiousness goes up, and then everything just kind of goes in and out. Right. Very true. Yeah. Very good point. All right. All right. Okay, so mm -hmm. we're here on the concept build, building. They have difficulty with new concepts, so wherever possible, new concepts should be related to previously learned ones. So bring mm -hmm. them back reviewing what was learned previously and connecting that yeah you know mm -hmm. connecting and making that connection that's important it's because we get very away from important. The, the classroom yes. that's something we just go on to the next thing go on to the next thing mm -hmm. and we didn't tie in you know what was previously learned to make that connection right and that's a good thing to point out when looking at curriculum too because sometimes curriculum is written not very well where it doesn't build on the previous concept and so if you have a good curriculum it will build on those and, and bring those concepts back in. And it makes it easier for your student, especially if they do struggle with math like this. Very much so. Mm -hmm. Very, very true. So the connection with the previous concept helps to build confidence in the subject and provides a framework upon which to build mastery of new skills. So then yeah. you can build up and you can enhance um, mm -hmm. a new skill. Yeah. Yeah. So we want to do that. Yeah. We don't want learning gaps. <laughs> no. There's time wasted. Yes. <laughs> it could be. It could be. Mm -hmm. So, again, going back to the real world examples with math, um, using your fingers, you when performing calculations at, at an age that's appropriate. We know mm -hmm. in older age groups, but we're talking about, I'm, I'm looking at all variations of ages. Um, right. Teaching a new skill, addition, multiplication is made easier when the instructor gives real world examples or allows for physical representations of the math problem. Mm -hmm. You know, math mm -hmm. problems itself. You know, making charts, uh, doing visuals, showing, drawing it out. Don't right. really, you know, we get, like I said, technology. We've mm -hmm. gotten away from actually using paper and pencil to, to right. figure it out, you know. And, uh -huh. use, you know, whatever you need to do. You can, I always say, go look in your, uh, your pantry. Mm -hmm. and pull out, you know, I, I, when I was growing up, I remember using beans and, uh, different uh, macaroni noodles. Oh and, yeah, and, exactly. You know, it's <laughs> anything, oh, you, anything tangible you can find to make groups. You can mm -hmm. use make groups for multiplication. Yeah. You know, kids get so excited because they're using food and they always get yeah. some <laughs> <favorite> food. <laughs> right. <laughs> so of course, my high schoolers, you know, you might have a different approach, but I'm just mm -hmm. looking at all age groups, whatever for works right you know. and for word problems just drawing what you Draw. hear and yeah. getting it on the page can translate that so much better than right. if you're just trying to pull all that picture together in your head because it you can read it and go what did that mean and right. if you write it down it's like okay they said to draw this and then that was this much bigger and oh i see it now right. Right. <laughs> and oftentimes those math problems are written in a way that if you follow it through step by step, you actually will create the proper image. <laughs> so. right. And you'll get it. It'll like you have an epiphany and you're just like, wow, I get it. Yeah. And even on assessment, uh, as assessment specialists, um, we evaluate in the area um, of math where it's math concepts and uh, applications. Mm. And they even ask you for um, scratch, scratch paper and you can use paper. 
mm-hmm. and they want you to draw it out. And you have to keep that as a tool, as a part of the assessment, because they, they want to know, can you be able to work out this problem on mm-hmm. paper? That's actually part of one of the uh, the tests. Yeah. 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 So it's, it's important. So we look at that. We look at, hey, they might not have got the answer right, mm-hmm. but they might have missed it by a mark. We know they understand the concept. Mm-hmm. They just missed the calculation, but they understand how to get the answer. They just missed the step. So you get right. to see, oh, wow, they really got the foundation. They just need a little bit more support in this area. Right. You know, so yeah. it tells you a lot. It really tells mm-hmm. you a lot. Yeah. And-